Lee Chess is down. So we're just playing on this guest system. Let's just bring the knight through attacking the pawn. Shall we hit the center as we do? Let's take the pawn. Take the queen. Attack the pawn. The bishop always comes to defend. Shall we do this? No, let's do this. Let's attack the pawn. Even though the knight is protecting. So this is just going to... Oh, it's not actually. I thought the pawn would have dropped. Alright, so they're moving very quickly. I'm going to bring our bishop into the game a little bit. Let's take the knight off the board. We could look to hit the bishop or we could just take our time and just chill. Maybe queenside castle. I think we're going to queenside castle. Just chilling the beans. So he's attacking. Pawns blocked by the bishop. So we can hit the bishop with a small piece. Maybe bring the knight here, attacking the rook. Attack the rook. Don't want to keep too much tension. Let's take with the check on the king. And let's hit the knight. Make it make a decision. Or oh, doesn't do um, preemptive on this. Let's take. Still blocking this pawn for a brief moment. Bit of space here. And they've got the pawn. We attack the bishop. First. And then what comes to defend that pawn? The rook. So the rook is playing defense nanny. Okay. Bishop can attack the rook. But we can always just bring the rook up. And they are doing. Let's just bring the rook up. This pawn's got no protection and we do have a check on their king, so I think I'm going to take that opportunity. Okay, and we can attack their rook. Is that going to work for us? Don't see it being too much of a problem. Yeah, okay, let's go with that. Go for a bishop exchange. Just about to say that one. Let's go for the bishop exchange. He's got our pawn here with his rook. Do we have something special? No, we can't protect the pawn. We're going down in flames. Oh, and the bishop is protecting this square. If we did this and they took with the pawn, then we would get the mate. But he's going to take with the bishop, isn't he? Yeah, they are. So let's bring the knight across and defend, but it's not going to be defending for long. Because the pawn is going to hit it. Okay, if we come here, maybe we get to attack their pawn at the top. Hmm. Okay, we're going to have to move the knight. Felt like we were doing better than that. Let's go here with the rook. Attacking the pawn. Sorry. He's trying to make his way in. He's going to get this pawn passed. Let's go here. We do have a checkmate if they forget themselves, but they're going slow now, so they're not going to take the pawn anymore, which is a shame because the knight is protecting. You know. See? Oh, but still. But still. Because the knight is protecting these areas. So the bishop comes to defend or something. It's still checkmate. Rook comes here. It's checkmate. <gasps> A discovered checkmate. Waiting for another 10 minutes zero game. See how we get on. Let's push this pawn up. Hmm. Okay, let's just develop the knight safely. Let's get the bishop out just tentatively. And let's castle. Let's capture. One of those strange players where they're just hovering around for nothing. Attack the bishop. Yeah. 
hovering around for nothing. Let's bring the rook here. The long pause, what is the tactic, tactical arrangement? Our king is here, it's the plan to get some sort of knights, get the queen in somehow. Let's prepare our minds for the attack on the king's side, because it looks like they're going queen side castling. They've got all the space, they've prepared it, it's good to go. And what do we do once we see the queenside castle? We don't want to overextend in the centre. We push this pawn and get this pawn up. Obviously we've got the knight to work as well. Doesn't look like they are. So they're holding off. With that particular movement. Let's attack the bishop. In the meantime. Bishops hovering around doing nothing. Let's just keep doing that. Looks like they're losing tempo. And eventually they get opened. Oh, they're taken with the knight. Let's push this pawn. And push it again. Okay, we can push this pawn. We want to do that just yet though, because it's going to let the knight in here. Bishop probably wants to come back a little bit, give a bit of space here. Making space here with his pawns. We want to get our knight in, let's get the knight in. Right, let's stop that pawn from going any further now. And shall we just bring the bishop here attacking the knight? Let's just bring the bishop here attacking the knight. Take the knight off the board. Why not? The knight looks like it's wanting to come here. We want him to go here. We don't have anything support in that area. Pawn has no protection, but we can't get to it. Looking to glorify the attack down here towards our king area. So we need to get rocking and rolling. Push here first <laughs> on the other side of the board. Okay, knight around, around, queen wants to be doing something, let's attack, don't think they're ready to attack though because they're building a, an attack towards our king Gary, yeah, can push but he just takes, so we can do this and then see if we do that. They may beat us to the punch, and they have queenside castled anyway. Now that's got to be a horse of a different colour, hasn't it? Attack, but he can hit our queen. Attack, and he can hit our queen. Takes, takes. Oh, it just drops. So all, all these pawns will just be locking their king in. So he wants to use our pieces, our pawns, as his castle. A reversed castle. Well, I'm having none of it. We'll leave it like this and... What can we knock down? Can't do this really because it just pushes here. But it does leave a space here for our bishop. But if we did that, it takes and then it's on this pawn. That's the weaker. I'm going to go here with the queen. And they moved there a little bit quick. I'm still going to go with that and lock it down now. Yes, yeah, so he's got a castle here. But he does have danger, danger zones. Maybe we can take some advantage. I would love for my knight to sit up there. But it's not going to get up. 
No, it's not going to get up, is it? Boom, boom, boom. No spaces, no spaces. I can't get in, I can't get in. Night, night. Yeah, okay, I'm going to have to do that, that, and that. But am I too late? <laughs> Looks like I'm too late to the party. Takes, green takes. We take, don't think we're interested in taking. Rooker comes across. Are we doing a Rook Rover? I think I'm bringing the Rook. Just treat it like a piece, it's nothing special. <clears throat> nothing special, we know the damage is coming, let's just take. Get some protection there, maybe get this Rook in. And what's his knight doing? Thinking he's doing queen, maybe. No, nope, queen's not right there, is it? That knight is doing nothing, really. Let's go on, hit the knight. Let's take with the rook. Or maybe take with the king. Do we need to bring the king in? No. I don't feel like bringing that down because then he's got more pressure to it. Let's take with the king. We need to get this rook somehow across here. We need to get the queen somehow across here. And they're beating us to the punch. He's doing something, but we can attack the queen. What was he trying to do there? Oh, he's trying to come here, wasn't he, to attack this? No, he's not. He's putting a check on the king. So if we hit the queen... And he takes with the pawn. We have to take with the pawn. We have to take with the pawn. And then he's got, is he fast enough to go and get? Ooh. And just move the king out of the way, you know. Move the king out of the way because he's coming for this pawn here. Yeah, let's just move the king out of the way and then attack the queen. Probably thinking he's being cheeky coming around the back, but ooh, let's do this. Yeah, he's just being cheeky as well. He's coming around the back, he's attacking the pawn, but the pawn has got protection on, so. Even if he's going up for these pawns, they're all protecting each other. He's going to have to swing his little self back out again. Threatening the mate thing. He's not doing that. This must be good for us because we can take this pawn here. We take the pawn. Can attack this pawn because the rook is on their queen. Is hitting our rook, so again, the feeling that they're being a bit clever. This rook is protecting this pawn, so we can move the rook here. We can still come and attack it with the damn queen. Is it better coming here? Yeah, let's come here. Got time to take this pawn. Oh, thank you very much. Okay, another guest game. I'll have to check if um, Lee Chess is on. Back on again. Let's just attack the pawn. Let's bring the knight through supporting the pawn. Big think. Got the four knights. We've got the queen supporting the pawn, we've got the knight supporting the pawn. Let's go for it. Take. They're moving slow, so the bishop's coming out. Normally they just take the knight off the board. They're thinking of tactical things. How do we get this pawn here for freeze type thing? All of those things going in the head, but they're just going to bring the bishop out. <gasps> Shiver me timbers. Yes, 
I said they were thinking of something tactical, didn't I? Knight takes. Queen comes across. Bishop maybe comes. Pawn attacks the knight. Knight takes the knight. We can probably do that beforehand. So we'll go here first. It's not actually done that. I thought the queen was coming here. Does that move order done slightly wrong because we've got a minor piece up? Might be. Let's do what we would do in this type of opening. Just bring the bishop here, targeting. What's he done? Small piece, second higher piece. These occasions, I usually I probably just push the pawn, but seeing as we're a minor piece up, may as well continue trying to get their pieces off the board, trading down. If it was even Stevens, I think I would have just pushed the pawn. There's still the element of putting pressure on the knight with the queen. Going into the long think again, thinking tactical. So the knight is being attacked, so the queen, my king is going to get a check on it, so we might not get castled. I have to bring this here, but um, are we panicking for nothing? Piece for a piece, but is it a piece for a piece? We take the bishop, he takes the knight, we take the pawn. He gets a, he's got the piece back in a sense, hasn't he? We don't really want that, so I'm going to bring the knight here. I'm telling my story. Okay, um, we can put a check on his king. In is that almost? But it's not really a checkmate because the bishop can go back, can't it? Because we then could attack it. It's not going to give us much, really. But hey, let's put the check on the king. Bishop comes back. Attack the bishop. But then it does have movement attacking the queen. So this pawn is free, but I don't know if we're going for it because we haven't got castled yet ourselves. And we could pay the price for not castling. I think probably castle queen side to support the bishop because it's just going to be hanging there. Okay, the bishop's gone. So let's attack. Rook comes here, the bishop can take it off the board, but I don't think they'll do that. I think they'll be attacking the queen. Have I just overregged it yet again? Rook's gone into the corner. Queen can take the pawn. Greedy munching for a pawn, but then we lose the bishop. But then we can take the rook with a check on the king, so it evens itself out, doesn't it? Although, is it a waste? We take. Rook comes back again, protected by the bishop. Bring the queen back so the bishop can't move. What looks different? What looks different? I think I'm just going to take the pawn.
Take with the check like we said. Bishop has to defend. We take the queen off the board. And that's going to be checkmate. Well, it's the longest that I've seen Lee Chess be down. But it's not. Problem landing on the page. Interesting. Maybe I need to sort my cache out or something and just restart. But this one seems to be working okay. Let's go here. No, in fact, it's not me. They said they've got some technical problems. I need to concentrate on the game. Let's take. Let's not get fancy. Bring the bishop through. Get the knight across. Bring this pawn up. And let's go for the king. Let's push the pawn. Let's push. Take. And we haven't castled yet, so just be mindful. This pawn doesn't have any protection. Does the bishop get locked out of the game though? I'm going to take. And then we're going to attack the queen and the bishop. Sorry, not with the queen. With the knight. Bishop's laying flat. Probably just going to take a pawn just to get compensation, but get the queen. Oh, he's going for the bishop. Going to have to take. And then take. Go for a check on the king before we take the center pawn. Check on the king. And hit the queen. And take the pawn maybe, but I don't know about greedy munching the pawn when he's going to be putting a check on our queen, king. Going to be dropping here. Should we castle first? I think we should. King safety is key, so tempting to not. So tempting to not. But, oh we can't. Uh -huh. May as well attack the queen then. We can't. Uh -huh. Too late to the party. Let's take. Oh, check on the king. Need to double up, really, don't we? Let's try. Mm -hmm. Oh, not opposite the. Rook, dude. <laughs> That's a rookie mistake. Let's get this rook here. Take. Mm, no way in. It's no. Go here. Let's push the palm. Somebody's coming for this file. Not them. Just in. Let's go here. <sighs> Two on one on the pawn. Okay. Let's attack. Can't defend both. Let's take. Mm, options and choices take and take or just block Going to take it's going for the exchange I can't see with this small screen I've got how what's the oh they've resigned 